I got a question on the palette change video uh, about the radiation suit and the berserk palette. Um, so also I can also cover the uh, item palette. So when you grab an item, uh, something actually kind of weird is in Doom I read that the code um, somehow skips the first uh, sort of sequence in the palette. So like 10 here, you're not going to see that. It's going to go straight to 11, 12, and 13. Um, so I thought that was kind of interesting. Same thing with the pain palette. It, this uh, pain palette number two here is actually never used. Um, as soon as you get hurt, it instantly goes to three and progresses upwards, you know, depending on how much you got hit. So anyway, number 14 is the radiation suit. And so what you would want to do, um, there is the tint, which is what we're going to use. But first, I'd recommend getting rid of this so that you can start from a fresh and clean start because the way tint is going to work on this is it's going to take this slight um, green tint that you have right now and it's going to mix in whatever you do it's just going to mix in with that so let's get a clean start just remove it and then go to the default palette uh, you can duplicate it and it'll put it at the end of the row um, so you can so you get a lot of options here you can pull things ahead or push them back um, so in theory you could take like the maximum pain palette pull it all the way ahead put it in the third position and as soon as you take the first you're like standing on a damaging floor and it'll just max out redness so that, that's an option there as obnoxious as it, sound, as it sounds uh, but yeah so now we've got 14 uh the red suit is just nothing so we can tint it um maybe for the tint i want a little something blue um i can give you something like this and yeah so we can uh, leave that and i'll pull up the game later to show you um, now the berserk palette what it actually does is it when you grab it it goes to palette four and then later on it fades to palette three um, so yeah palette two is never used and yeah so palette so what you want to do is uh, probably i i wouldn't mess with this too much because you got to remember that you're going to get hit and it's you got I like you know personally I like the indication of the red screen to let you know that hey you know you got hit uh, um, you know start watching out but um, you could probably take like palette number two and give that to three and four and then you'll have at least a little bit of an indication they have berserk so you know you could go ahead and duplicate this twice so you got 15 and 16 um, go to palette three and then so if I remove palette three right palette four is going to move into the position now so i got rid of both of these uh it can get a little confusing you're gonna have to just play around with it a little to get a feel for it but um yes so i can pull this ahead and put it in the three position and take this one and put it in the four position uh yeah and now you've got now this is what the Berserk is going to look like. So let's go ahead and save our changes and load up the game. So for Berserk, now see it's, it's a lot more subtle so uh, maybe this is what you were looking for and now um, now when you just have Radsuit it looks blue like this so this is definitely an option you can do so anyways uh hope you enjoyed that hope that answered your question Till next time peace